No weapon formed against you shall prosper, and every tongue that rises against you in judgment, you shall condemn. You are established in righteousness, and oppression is far from you. The weapons of your warfare are not carnal but mighty through God to the pulling down of strongholds. You take the shield of faith and quench every fiery dart of the enemy. You take the sword of the Spirit, which is the word of God, and use it against the enemy. You are redeemed from the curse of the law, from poverty, sickness, and spiritual death. You overcome all because greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. You stand firm in the evil day with your loins girded with truth, the breastplate of righteousness, and your feet prepared with the gospel of peace. You hold the shield of faith and wear the helmet of salvation, wielding the sword of the Spirit, the Word of God. You are delivered from the power of darkness and translated into the kingdom of God's dear Son. You tread upon serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy, and nothing shall hurt you. You do not have the spirit of fear but of power, love, and a sound mind. You are blessed with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in Christ Jesus, and you are healed by the stripes of Jesus. Your hand is upon the neck of your enemies. The Lord anoints your head with oil, and your cup runs over. Goodness and mercy shall follow you all the days of your life. You are anointed to preach, teach, heal, and cast out devils. You have received abundance of grace and the gift of righteousness, and you reign in life through Jesus Christ. You have life and that more abundantly. You walk in the light as he is in the light, and the blood of Jesus cleanses you from all sin. You are the righteousness of God in Christ. You are the head and not the tail. You shall decree a thing, and it shall be established in your life. You have favor with God and with man. Wealth and riches are in your house, and your righteousness endures forever. You will be satisfied with long life, and God will show you his salvation. You dwell in the secret place of the Most High, and you abide under the shadow of the Almighty. No evil will befall you, and no plague shall come near your dwelling. Your children are taught of the Lord, and great is their peace. You are strengthened with might by His Spirit in your inner man, and you are rooted and grounded in love. You are sitting in heavenly places in Christ, far above all principality, power, might, and dominion. You take your position in the heavens and bind the principalities and powers that operate against your life in the name of Jesus. You break and rebuke every program in the heavens that would operate against you through the sun, the moon, the stars, and the constellations. You bind and rebuke any ungodly forces operating against you through Arcturus, Pleiades, Nazareth, and Orion. You bind and rebuke all moon deities and demons operating through the moon in the name of Jesus. You bind all sun deities and demons operating through the sun in the name of Jesus. You bind all deities and demons operating through the stars and planets in the name of Jesus. The sun shall not smite you by day nor the moon by night. The heavens were created to be a blessing to your life. You receive the rain and blessing from heaven upon your life in the name of Jesus. I pray for angels to be released to war against any spirit in the heavens assigned to block your prayers from being answered. You bind the prince of the power of the air in the name of Jesus. I pray for the floodgates of heaven to be opened over your life. I pray for an open heaven and bind any demonic interference from the heavens against you and your family in the name of Jesus. Let the evil powers of heaven be shaken in the name of Jesus. Let the heavens drop dew upon your life. Bow the heavens and come down, I decree. Let the heavens be opened over your life and let you see visions. I shake the heavens and fill your house with God's glory. I send thunder in the heavens against the enemy that is after your life in the name of Jesus. O Lord our God, let the heavens drop at your presence. Let the heavens praise your wonders. O Lord, show your wonders in the heavens. Ride upon the heavens and release your voice. O Lord, release your manifold wisdom to the powers in the heavens in the mighty name of Jesus. Hear me, child of God, as I continue to declare over your life, 
I pray you break off any limitations and restrictions placed on your life by any evil spirits in the name of Jesus. You bind and cast out all python and constrictor spirits in the name of Jesus. God bless you indeed and enlarge your coast. Let God's hand be with you and keep you from evil. Cast out your enemies and enlarge your borders. The Lord has promised to enlarge your borders. Enlarge your heart so you can run the way of his commandments. Your mouth is enlarged over your enemies. Enlarge your steps so you can receive his wealth and prosperity. You receive deliverance and enlargement for your life. The Lord shall increase you more and more, you and your children. Let God's kingdom and government increase in your life. Let you increase in the knowledge of God. The Lord bless you and increase you. May you increase exceedingly. May you increase in wisdom and understanding. You shall increase in strength and confound your adversaries. Let God's grace and favor increase in your life. Let the years of your life be increased. Let the word of God increase in your life. Bless you in all your increase. Let your giving and tithes increase. Let your latter end greatly increase. You will grow in grace and in the knowledge of Jesus Christ. You will flourish like a palm tree and grow like a cedar in Lebanon. Let your faith grow exceedingly. The breaker has gone up before you and broken through every limitation and barrier of the enemy. The Lord is the God of the breakthrough. He has broken forth against your enemies. Your branches run over every wall erected by the enemy. You can run through a troop and leap over a wall. Let your line go through all the earth and your words to the end of the world. You are a joint heir with Jesus Christ. Give you the heathen for your inheritance and the uttermost parts of the earth for your possession. You renounce all lust, perversion, immorality, uncleanness, impurity, and sexual sin in the name of Jesus. You renounce all witchcraft, sorcery, divination, and occult involvement in the name of Jesus. You renounce all ungodly soul ties and immoral relationships in the name of Jesus. You renounce all hatred, anger, resentment, revenge, retaliation, unforgiveness, and bitterness in the name of Jesus. You forgive anyone who has hurt, disappointed, abandoned, mistreated, or rejected you in the name of Jesus. You renounce all addiction to drugs, alcohol, or any legal or illegal substance that has bound you in the name of Jesus. You renounce all pride, haughtiness, arrogance, vanity, ego, disobedience, and rebellion in the name of Jesus. You renounce all envy, jealousy, and covetousness in the name of Jesus. You renounce all fear, unbelief, and doubt in the name of Jesus. I declare over your life in the name of Jesus that you are delivered from every demonic power you face. You are moving from the grip of Satan into the grace of God. Let every obstacle in your path be divided, and may marine spirits and every force of darkness be destroyed by God's mighty power. Stand strong in the Lord and in the greatness of his might. As you trust in him, let the forces of evil bow to his authority, and may his power be revealed so that all may believe. May God release healing, deliverance, and restoration in your life. Let his voice thunder in majesty, and may you be in awe of his greatness. Through the power of the Holy Spirit, may apostles perform signs, wonders, and miracles in your midst. May God grant you the ability to speak his word with power and to preach and teach with the demonstration of his spirit. Let mighty angels be released to fight on your behalf, and may the power of Elijah be made manifest through God's prophets. I cover your mind and thoughts with the precious blood of Jesus. Every doorpost of your life and possessions is protected. You overcome the devil through the blood of Jesus, and as you apply his blood, you receive multiplied grace and peace. Through the everlasting covenant, you are made perfect, and you boldly enter the presence of God. Your conscience is cleansed from dead works, and you serve the living God. As you partake of Christ's body and blood, redemption is secured, and the power of evil is broken. Torment and fear are rebuked, 
and peace flows over your heart. You receive all the blessings of the new covenant, healing, prosperity, deliverance, and the fullness of the Holy Spirit. The blood of Jesus testifies to your salvation and victory. Every guilt, shame, and condemnation is renounced, and the power of sin is broken. Your heart is purified, and you resist the accusations of Satan. In the name of Jesus, all accusations are silenced, and every spirit of slander is rebuked. The voice of his blood speaks over your life, and no demonic power can accuse you. The Lord teaches your hands to fight and your fingers to wage war. You are his warrior in these end times, and he will use you as a weapon against the enemy. Your weapons are not of this world, but are mighty through God to pull down strongholds. Satan's battle is lost, and the enemies of the Lamb will be defeated. You do not fight in the flesh, but by the Spirit of the Lord. Let God thunder against your enemies, sending hail, fire, arrows, and lightning to scatter them. You are delivered from strong enemies and placed in a spacious place. You are God's battle axe, and He gives you victory over your adversaries. In the name of Jesus, you are His anointed, and He brings you great deliverance. You will crush your enemies into dust and scatter them in the streets. You will pursue and overtake your enemies. They will fall beneath your feet. You tread on lions, serpents, scorpions, and every power of the enemy. The wicked are ashes under your feet, and you rise to break the enemy into pieces. You rebuke every wild beast of the field and forest, every creeping spirit, and every lion that seeks to devour you. The door is closed to any demonic forces trying to enter your life, and in Jesus' name, every thief attacking your finances and joy is bound and cast out. Any spirit that tries to enter by stealth is exposed and expelled. The Lord cleanses your temple and drives out every thief. A standard is raised against any flood the enemy would bring into your life. Familiar spirits, demons blocking your path, and every trace of malice and wickedness are cast out. In Jesus' name, frog-like spirits and devils in high places are rebuked. You break all fellowship with devils, whether through sin, the flesh, or any ungodly sacrifice. Every devil is commanded to leave your household and your children. The Lord exposes any human agents of evil in your life and any hidden snares set against you. Every scheme of the devil is rebuked, and you are released from all his traps. You will not fall into condemnation, and no false doctrine will take root in your life. Every power of sacrifices made to devils in your city, region, or nation is nullified. The spirit of Molech and any spirit assigned to abort your destiny is bound and rebuked in Jesus' name. You are strengthened to fulfill your purpose, and every antichrist spirit is overcome because greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. You are free from every spirit of error, and victory is yours in Jesus' mighty name. In the mighty name of Jesus, I speak and decree with the authority of that name, Peace, be still, to every wind blowing against your blessings. Every blessing that has been delayed or hanging is released today in the mighty name of Jesus. I declare that every evil force and gang up plotting against your career, destiny, family, children, and grandchildren is frustrated and destroyed. It is written, They shall gather, but not by me, says the Lord, and every gathering against you will be scattered for your sake in Jesus' name. I decree that no wind of false doctrine or destruction sent against you will prevail. Every wind of destruction programmed to affect you, whether now or in the future, is cancelled in the mighty name of Jesus. As it is written, Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. I declare that all satanic programming is deactivated and made void. The evil programmers themselves are frustrated, for it is written, He makes the diviners mad and frustrates the plans of the wise. Right now, every evil plan is frustrated in Jesus' mighty name. Any wind programmed against your children to block their progress and success is cancelled in the name of Jesus. It is written, Who is he that speaks? And it comes to pass, if the Lord has not commanded it, 
Associate yourselves, all you people, and you will be scattered for the Lord's sake. Every word spoken to bring destruction to your life, business, health, children, church, and even your nation is nullified today in Jesus' name. I declare that every evil programmer set up by the enemy is put to shame, and they flee seven ways in the mighty name of Jesus. Every wind of destruction blown by household enemies, even those within your family, is commanded to be still in the name of Jesus. I decree that every evil altar sponsoring winds of destruction against your life, family, business, and career is destroyed by the mighty wind of the Lord. In the name of Jesus, these forces are uprooted and dismantled, and you are covered by God's protection and favor. Thank you, Father, because it is done in Jesus' mighty name. Amen.